Are you recording? I'm recording, yes. We've known each other a long time. I would say about um, 35 years. Probably. Maybe. Yeah. yeah, because we did a series together called Defenders of the Earth. Yes. And that's how we knew each other. And yeah. then we wound up on Batman together. That's right. We actually did. And both of us have long resumes of theater work. And for me, voiceover work, I started out as a singer, I'm a writer, I've done a lot of different things. And this one, the voiceover career, I've been doing over 40 years. And been very, very happy. And how many books did you write again? I wrote 19 books. Yeah. yeah. So That's pretty great. amazing. And Lauren works all the time as an actor on camera and as voice actor. I do a lot of movies and TV shows and, you know, yeah. theater. Yeah. Yeah. So. That's us. Yep. Just a question. What, would you guys recommend future aspiring voice actors to pursue higher education? Yes. Oh, definitely. Definitely. E everyone pursuing anything. <laughs> higher education, right? Well, we really yeah. do believe in that because I think we had a, what's we called, a panel discussion yeah. earlier, and Kevin, who plays Batman, emphasized that you need to be educated so that you can realize how broad the world is and all the things you can learn in the world. If you live a very narrow existence, meaning if you're not educated, um, you really don't understand all of the possible treasures there are out there, all of the different paths you can take. And, really important. And it's not enough to just take a voiceover class. You really have to take acting classes and be an actor first, and then a voice actor second. The, the best voice people are actors. Uh, thank you guys very thank much. You. You're most welcome.